Hello everybody, welcome back to my channel and welcome to the month of December. I cannot believe it's already the end of 2021. We are starting a brand new month and it's the most festive month of the year. I'm so excited for today's video because I am bringing you my first holiday gift guide. I'm hoping to have a few for you this month, but today I want to share a very special video because it's in collaboration with Twisted Lily. I cannot believe they reached out to me and they wanted to share some of their amazing fragrances. If you don't know about Twisted Lily, which I seriously doubt, let me tell you a little bit more about this incredible website. Twisted Lily is a unique and trusted fragrance destination, internationally recognized and prides itself in featuring hard to find niche, indie and natural fragrances from all over the world. What I love the most about Twisted Lily, it's a super user-friendly site to help you navigate and discover not only the incredible brands that they have, but also super helpful tools. I especially love the section where they're showcasing not only what's trending now and what's new, but really good ideas for a holiday gift guides. Their discovery sets are super accessible, but one of the things that I really like is the match your fragrance section on the website. So as you can see, it's such a cool concept where you can actually plug in your favorite fragrance and hunt for something new that is similar within that realm. They also categorize it by different fragrance profiles and families so that you can discover new fragrances within their site and they help you achieve that. I think that is such a cool concept. And additionally, all of these niche fragrances that we constantly hear about and potentially are not easy to find in your area, not only are you able to get your hands on all these really hard to find fragrances, but also you can actually buy samples of these particular fragrances and their spray samples and I cannot tell you how many times I have purchased even with my own money you know these samples that come in the little bladder that are just like the pull out thing and it's like the little it's just it's so complicated we want to experience a fragrance through a spray and the fact that they give you a spray vial for a really affordable price I think is ideal and Obviously, they gave me a code for you guys. So it's Scented Life 10. So you're able to save 10% off on all of your fragrances, including those samples. So with that being said, thank you so much, Twisted Lily, for partnering out for this portion of the video. Let's get started because I have a lot of things to share. If this is your first time here, well, welcome. Hi, my name is Moraima. In this channel, I share some of my passions, such as fragrance, self-care, and decor. And I strongly invite you to become a part of the Scented Tribe because we have a lot of fun. And besides that, if you are a returning subscriber and you haven't subscribed, I want to make it a December goal to make it to 5k before my birthday. So my birthday is at the end of the year, December 30th is when I was born and I'm asking for a birthday present if we can get this tribe to 5k. Do you guys think we can do it? I really think we can. So if you haven't subscribed, you've watched a couple of videos, consider subscribing. Okay, now let's get started. So how do you like the decor? You know, I wanted to do a little bit of a holiday decoration. Definitely, we have to be festive. We have to celebrate. I think this holiday season is going to be even brighter and happier than the ones previous before because now, you know, we are able to be a little bit closer to our loved ones. But Anyways, talking about our loved ones, we're going to have a lot of gift buying to do. And one of the first things that Twisted Lily sent me is an incredible idea. So this is a discovery set from the House of Sergio. This, I think, is a really, really good idea for any fragrance lover. A lot of these high-end brands are super pricey and sometimes not only is it not part of our budget, but at the same time, we don't know what fragrance would be ideal for someone that, you know, is into fragrance, is a fragrance lover, and at the same time, maybe they are interested in finding out a whole bunch of different ones. So let me just show you what this comes like. It's such a beautiful box. And you know what I love about the color? The fact that it's burgundy. This could be an incredible gift for a man or a woman. So I absolutely love the fact that it is super neutral and is super unisex. So anyone, either a man or a woman, is going to feel super happy and it's going to feel very personalized. It's not going to feel like, you know, you grab something feminine and you gave it to, to a man. So let's see if I can open it up without... Um, disturbing here. The first thing we see, I don't know if the lights are going to show it. The first thing we see, it's a booklet. And I absolutely love the idea of having a little bit of information about these fragrances. And this is what the fragrances look like. So I'm going to quickly name you what's inside. We're not going to go through all of the fragrances today, but I really wanted to give you an idea 
So in this booklet, you get not only a little bit of information of other Surjoff fragrances from the house of Surjoff, I believe it's some of the most popular ones and it tells you a little bit about them. But at the end of the booklet at the back, then you start getting information on each fragrance and what are the notes, what are they made of, what are their names, et cetera, et cetera. And I think this is super helpful because as the person is taking the journey and discovering all of these fragrances, they can read a little bit about it. It's a whole experience. Sometimes, I don't know, maybe a glass of wine. So in this discovery set, you have eight fragrances and you have Naxos, Herbapura, Neo, you have Alexandria, two because i think there's an alexandria one and an alexandria two you have renaissance more than words cruz del sur two and Accento, which I actually really, really like. And I like Accento Overdose as well. I feel like this is an ideal gift that still stays within a good budget range, especially if you take advantage of that extra 10% off. And at the same time, you're able to cater and really make that fragrance lover super happy because this is a super luxurious, really exciting type of gift to receive. I would love to receive something like that. And I'm super happy that Twisted Lily sent it over so that I can show it to you guys. So as I said in one of my previous videos I'm going to be doing another video where we're going to be sharing and sniffing all kinds of different samples and see if they're full bottle worthy this particular discovery set is going to go in one of those videos and because I have so many fragrances that I want to share with you I didn't want to go into each and every one of them but I still really wanted to share with you this particular discovery set and they have a ton of different discovery sets so once again this was the discovery set for search off what is it is there a particular name no, no, there's not a particular name to this one. So I believe that's the current surge of discovery set. And the next fragrance that Twisted Lily shared with me is the beautiful Herbapura, which we just saw it was in the discovery kit. But this is one of the fragrances that I've been wanting for a long time. And I just had to show you the box. I'm sure you've seen it. This is what it looks like inside in all its glory. So guys this color if you saw my last video you know that I really really enjoy this beautiful turquoise color I know that this one is a little bit deeper than that Tiffany blue but this is just incredible it is so gorgeous and I know that any fragrance lover in your life would be ecstatic to have a fragrance like this especially because Serge Off is a brand that has such incredible performance I know that I haven't smelled any surge off just yet that has 100% disappointed me. The only one that I have a little bit of a hard time I smelled once was like Cruz del Sur, but I think I need to revisit that one. But for the most part, everything I've been able to smell is gorgeous. And this one, oh my goodness. So this is a fragrance that is a little bit more appropriate during the spring and summertime, but nevertheless is a beautiful, beautiful fragrance. You don't even need to spray it. I mean, you just open the cap and it's like, Oh, it is incredible and I'm gonna tell you a little bit about this fragrance. I have a few other fragrances that are very similar to this one and I was always curious about Herbapura because a lot of people would say yes Herbapura is very similar to these other ones such as Kirk and Jasmine Wisp and all of that but it's smoother it's better and I'm like oh my god well maybe one day and you know when you go through one of those situations where you buy all of the cheaper ones but at the end of the day what you really want is the one that has the best performance and is the smoothest and the most luxurious one well this is one of those scenarios so let's take a look at this scent profile this is fresh and fruity and musky at the same time it just has like a presence you know it has weight and i have to agree with everyone that said to me that this was a way better blended version of that fruity fragrance that i was constantly looking for that had that packed the punch that had the incredible performance it's gorgeous 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 because I've never shared it in my channel, I'm gonna quickly tell you a little bit about the notes. On the main accords, it has citrus, fruity, sweet, musky, powdery, vanilla, amber, fresh, spicy, and animalic. But don't get scared about that. I don't smell anything animalic about this fragrance. On the top notes, we're starting with Sicilian orange, Calabrian bergamot, and Sicilian lemon. So super bright and citrusy at the opening of this fragrance. In the middle notes, we have fruit notes. You know, we don't know. Search Off is a house that likes to keep a couple of notes private to themselves. So, you know, I'm not surprised that they're just saying fruity notes. And then on the base, we have white musk, Madagascar vanilla, and amber. Guys, this takes 
spot number one absolutely this is way better than all of the other ones that i was trying to you know get to this scent profile and i ended up getting before you know having the opportunity to get this one another one that i absolutely love which if you haven't seen my video i will leave the information below is achenta overdose as you can see they're very very similar just one is gold and the other one is turquoise this fragrance is equally as good as beast mode super powerful so this is these two i would say are for the fresh fruity love I think these are super safe bets so either or I would think it's a really really good option I'm gonna leave all of the information down in the link below and all of the fragrances that I'm going to be sharing today are mainly luxury brands which obviously you can get at Twisted Lily these are the only ones they send me the next ones are all from my collection but you can also take advantage of the discount on their website another thing that I wanted to share is that the only fragrances that I'm gonna get into the notes are the ones that I haven't spoken about in my channel just for time purposes because I want to be able to to not make this video eight hours long and the next duo that i want to share with you is in the montal house and these are my favorite that i would consider for gifting someone or taking advantage of the deal for yourself and we have arabian stanka and intense cafe to me these are the two most i can't say those are the two best from montal because i haven't smelled every montal but the ones i've smelled so far these are the ones that have my heart these are the ones that i have a full size bottle because i absolutely love them obviously we know that intense cafe it's a beautiful jammy rose coffee vanilla jammy rose that it's beautiful for this time of the year it's great for the holiday parties that we're going to be attending and arabian sanka it's a beautiful saffron oud super sweet it has rose and bergamot at the same time, but it has amber and tonka bean. It's a powerhouse. This fragrance arrives before you do and it's super, super sexy. The same way you see the bottle, the black and gold, very seductive. That's exactly how this fragrance is and I absolutely love it. So these are two of the ones that I feel any fragrance lover would be super excited to receive as a holiday gift. The next fragrance that I think is super safe and a lot of women would be happy and thrilled to receive is Gentle Fluidity Gold by MFK. This is such a beautiful, amber vanilla oh my god and one of the reasons also why i wanted to showcase this fragrance not only because of how beautiful it is but take a look at the size this is the super cute 35 ml which is a really good size a really good amount and obviously you can get them at twisted lily and you can get that discount so if buying a full size bottle or a larger bottle is a little bit out of your price range this is still a super amazing gift and is just super luxurious is beautiful and every woman would be super ecstatic to receive and every single scent profile from the mfk house you can get in this particular size but anyways back to this mm -mm. it's vanilla it's powdery it's amber it's sophisticated is just class this is just class in a bottle is super 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 nice i absolutely love it to me this is one of, a lot of people say it reminds them of intense cafe I mean, I could see that in a very like far away, but this is, this is a lot more feminine. I feel like this is a little bit more sophisticated. For example, I'm going to give you a really good example. So this I would wear to a beautiful upscale, sophisticated dinner. Maybe I would wear intense cafe. However, I would wear Intense Cafe to go clubbing, but I wouldn't wear Gentle Fluidity Gold to go clubbing. I feel like it's not loud enough. Like it's not dark enough like this is a lot more dainty and beautiful and classic and feminine it's just super chic and not necessarily as deep and as dark as when is a night on the town but i absolutely love it oh my god oh my god oh my god i love it so i am just waiting to go through this particular bottle to get the other one i wanted to try and see if this size would be would last me long enough and i feel like i use them pretty much at the same level as the larger bottle so i don't really think it's necessary to get a larger bottle unless it's a fragrance that you wear very very often but these type of fragrances that are a little bit more of a special occasion type fragrances maybe not Mm, I absolutely love it and I feel that this would make a beautiful beautiful gift once again this was Gentle Fluidity Gold by Maison Francesque de Jean the next duo that I want to bring you guys is another duo that uh, I was trying not to put it in this video but it's just so hard not to because if there is a time during the year that I feel they deserve to shine if there's a time during the year that I feel like this is their 
stage to be at the forefront is now not only because of the season not only because of the excuses we have to get ourselves something nice but also if you are looking to make someone feel extremely extremely special I can almost guarantee you 100% that it would be a win if you choose any of these two. And obviously I'm speaking about the Baccarat Rouge duo. Oh my God, guys, these two are just incredible, incredible. And like I said, when we're talking, not only because it's red and it's so Christmassy and it's luxury and they're just, to me, I just look at these bottles and to me I feel Christmas I feel festive I feel you know celebration I see these bottles and I see the word celebration let me know in the comments below if you feel the same way as well so either or of these two this one is a little bit more pricier than this one or you can get any of the Baccaras in the size on the 35 ml so it doesn't have to be the 70 ml it could be the 35 ml but all I'm saying is that these two scent profiles are big winners and everybody loves them. They have, this has to be one of the most duped fragrances worldwide. It's just incredible. Oh, uh, it's sweet cotton candy and saffron and it's just, oh, it's such a good fragrance. I don't, I don't even know. I mean how they did this and I'm not gonna praise it too, too much because we know that we all love Baccarat Rouge 540 or Baccarat Rouge 540. The sister, the Baccarat Rouge Extrait, it's a little bit more of a almondy saffron with jasmine. It has woody nose, it has a little bit of musk. So this one is a little bit deeper. I like to wear this one a little bit more when it's super cold outside. I feel like it's a little bit more appropriate, but if I'm going to a party and I know that I'm gonna be taking my jacket off and I'm going to, you know, not have as many layers on, then Baccarat Rouge 540 is just as good, I think, any of these fragrances will not disappoint and I love the fact that now they have these two scent profiles in the 35 um, in the 35 bottle. I feel that they already had the OG and they just recently released the Extrait. So it's a great opportunity to offer something super special to that special someone or to yourself at a discount and at the same time to enjoy it because I really feel that this holiday season is going to be a little bit extra special and a little bit more filled with love because obviously we're able to be a little bit closer to our loved ones. Mm, I absolutely love it, love it, love it. Once again, these were Baccarat Rouge 540 by Maison Francis Goulouche. As you can see, guys, this video is pure luxury. We are taking the heavy hitters out. We are taking the actual, the creme de la creme. And sometimes you just have to, especially when the holidays and the festivities are starting, it is just the most appropriate time of the year. The last three fragrances I wanna share with you are from another luxury house. And these were generously gifted by Roja Parfum and I want to share them with you and the very first one that they sent me that I would love to share with you is Elixir. Now I want to tell you a little bit more about this particular line and let me just tell you if this doesn't already say holiday and it's ready to just be a gift I don't know what else is where you have these particular boxes and as you open them they are in a bed of silk. I'm sure you've seen these bottles if you watch a lot of perfume reviews. I'm sure you've seen these fragrances, but like seriously, don't these look already like an incredible gift? And obviously they are from a luxury brand. You can't expect less, but I was super stoked when I generously received these from Roja Parfum. So thank you so much, Roja, for sending these my way. I'm super excited, but I want to tell you a little bit more about these fragrances. And not only that, what I discover about this particular line. So the very first fragrance that I want to share with you is this beautiful pink blush pink bottle. It is just incredible. It's super, super beautiful. I've seen this obviously on videos, you know, like everyone that have seen reviews about them or actual photos on Instagram. But when you see the bottle in person it is just 10 times better than what I expected. And oh my goodness, 
So this one is Elixir and this one is the only one that is not purple. All of the other ones are purple and this is the beautiful blush pink. I think it's so delicate. It's so feminine. It's so beautiful. I showed it to you in the box because obviously I just, you know, it's a box that needs to be shown. These particular Essence de Parfum are the introductory level of their permanent line. So I feel that these are ideal for those who are starting to get to know Raja as a brand and getting to know their fragrances because obviously their Parfum concentration are definitely heavy and they're up there and this is an incredible way to really get into the Raja scent profile and still feel a little bit comfortable if you don't like anything that is extremely loud. This is a beautiful amber floral that is extremely, but extremely feminine. Super floral, super delicate. So if you have someone who is not into those extreme heavy hitters, fragrance arrives before you do, you know, someone that is a little bit more reserved, this is an ideal fragrance. I absolutely love it. It's fruity, it's powdery, it's floral. Let's take a look at the atomizer because these atomizers, let me just tell you, they are incredible. You see that? Oh. Who wouldn't be impressed by an atomizer like that? This is a beautiful, beautiful floral fluty scent. And I'm gonna be extremely honest with you. I had, throughout the year, I have heard not the greatest thing about this particular, out of the whole line, but this particular one. And I was like, how is that possible? The bottle is so beautiful. But obviously you don't know, appearances could be deceiving, but I don't know what everyone's smelling this is beautiful now does it have the beast mode projection that they are potentially expecting no as we said this is a, i mean look at the bottle this is delicate this is feminine it's super dainty it's not sharp you know that it's a floral fruity scent that is extremely well blended and it's going to be a little bit more discreet than an extreme monster you cannot compare this for example to intense cafe it's a completely different type of scent profile and it's a completely type of fragrance with a different purpose which is why i believe they're called essence this is the type of fragrance that you want someone to get close to you and smell you and get up close and personal and you want them to stay there if a fragrance is too beastly they cannot stay there they're gonna choke you know but when you have something soft and it's just beautiful they just want to stay and continue to smell the same way when you wear it you just want to smell yourself and you just don't want to stop Oh, it's beautiful. It's beautiful. I know that you have probably seen, you know, the, the notes, but this is the first time I'm sharing it on my channel and I definitely want to tell you a little bit more about them. So on the main accords, we're starting with powdery, fruity, rose, sweet, woody, musky, floral, vanilla, violet, and yellow floral. And then for the notes, it is a plethora of notes. There's a lot, but it's still super well blended. At the top notes, we have bergamot, middle notes, raspberry, rose de may, peach, violet, heliotrope, ylang ylang, geranium, jasmine, lily of the valley. On the base notes, we have musk, vanilla, cashmere wood. We have orris, violet leaf, ambered musk, sandalwood, cedar, and cinnamon. I don't smell the cinnamon at all. Mmm. It is such a beautiful, delicate, it's just, I really, really enjoy it. I would say this is extremely office safe. This is meeting the parents safe. And if you look at the bottle, it's very similar to Tiffany Rose Gold that I just reviewed on my last video. They're both that rose gold shade. It's very similar. Like these would be in the same category. Rose gold is a little bit more sparkling, a little bit more bright. This is a little bit more sophisticated, floral, you know, a little bit more romantic. This is a much more romantic fragrance. And this is exactly what I interpret it when I smell it. So if you know that special someone who's a very feminine, romantic, reserved kind of girl, she would definitely enjoy something like this. And I absolutely love it. Thank you so much, Roja. Once again, this was Essence de Parfum Elixir by Roja Parfum. The next fragrance that I think would be an incredible hit is Roja de Parfum Essence Reckless. So this is the next one we have here. It comes in the same box, right, with the silk bedding. Look at this, guys. I mean, it is just luxury at its finest. I mean, this presentation, 
it's just the attention to detail I tell you someone opens this up as a present it doesn't matter the time of the year even if it's not holiday season they would be impressed this is just a gorgeous 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 so this one is reckless and I'm so excited because you know that the last video I shared with you guys that I got um, 51 from Roja and the other two that I really wanted to have were exactly this too reckless and elixir from Roja Parfum and it's so incredible that those are the ones exactly that they just sent me I had no idea I absolutely had no idea anyways this is another beautiful purple bottle it has the same Swarovski rhinestones the same cap it is beautiful and just by the way I don't know if I did it on the 51 but they're all the same bottles all the same cap obviously it stands the test of you know not dropping that is important because you know I personally store my fragrances upright so I need to hold them by the cap to get them out this one is gorgeous mm. so this one is the infamous potentially similar to Love Don't Be Shy by Killian potentially in the same realm of Centra by Memo Paris and let me just tell you that obviously it's the same atomizer mm, it's gorgeous 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 so yes they're right this is in the same family they live in the same vicinity so very much in the vicinity of Love Don't Be Shy and Centra by Memo it's that beautiful sweet neroli orange with a little bit of rose but this one doesn't have any marshmallow notes I think this one is different enough to have even if you have Love Don't Be Shy because of that marshmallow and the Love Don't Be Shy goes a little bit in another direction this one is going to have a little bit more the rose and the geranium that is going to take it from another direction and it has sandalwood and pink pepper so it's a little bit it's just it smells like they're similar but they're not I really really enjoy it obviously this is going to be also a fragrance that is going to be a little bit more conducive towards the spring and summertime let's dive a little bit deeper into this fragrance and see what it's all about the main accords we have citrus vanilla white floral warm spicy powdery amber musky cinnamon rose and sweet and for the top notes we're starting with mandarin orange orange bergamot on the middle notes we have jasmine neroli may rose and geranium and on the base notes we have vanilla musk benzoin cinnamon sandalwood pink pepper centrax and coriander it is just a little bit different but yes it's a little bit in the same profile so if you know that someone likes those particular fragrances then you know that this potentially is a safe bet I think it's beautiful this is more of a fun during the day or on a day date or going shopping I think the name is right on the dot I mean reckless this is a fragrance that makes you feel like it's time to just have fun let loose and live a little I absolutely love 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 this fragrance and I'm really happy that I have it in my collection because I have 51 that it's a little bit more dressy and a little bit more subdued and this is a little bit more fun and I'm telling you the names are just incredible this is exactly what I feel like mm, I absolutely love it and I'm super stoked to have it again like I said it is such a gorgeous bottle I think these Essence de Parfum by Roja are the ideal entry point to dive into that brand and really get to know what is their scent DNA and how the designer builds these fragrances without necessarily starting with the heavy heavy price points and again like I said these are also available at Twisted Lily take advantage of that discount and I truly believe that these are the type of fragrances that allow you to really share high-end luxury at a much more affordable price once again this was Reckless Essence de Parfum by Roja and the last fragrance I have for you in this super exclusive luxury gift guide for women for this holiday season it's another fragrance that I got graciously gifted by Roja as well and I could not I mean this is the epitome if you want to blow somebody's mind you show up with one of those bottles either this or the Baccarat Rouge 540 so this is just let's take a look at these boxes incredible the gold this is amber oud and this is just luxury at its finest guys let's take a look at what this bottle looks like it also comes in its beautiful satin sheet and this is the 30 ml which is the travel format that's why it says um, parfum voyage or travel perfume and this is something that I don't know I wouldn't travel with it because it is just so luxury you guys let's take a look at this look at this beauty 
I mean, I'm gonna try to have like better video so that you can understand. <laughs> this is just incredible. If you have someone who is an amber lover, a spicy lover, this is amber spicy. This is ideal for the colder freezing temperatures that we're about to get into. Or if wherever you are, it doesn't get freezing temperatures, but at least, you know, it gets super chilly. This fragrance shines like nobody's business. And guys, I am just, I mean, just with the packaging, you are impressing someone. Look at these rhinestones. Let me see if I can. Let me just do a little bit of a close up. Let's see if I can do a close up. Let's see if I can have these. Look at this, guys. Do you see this? It's incredible. I mean, the whole cab is rhinestones. It is just, it has a plaque in the front. It has the name on the side. It's just gorgeous. Anyways, let's zoom you back out. And let's talk about this, right? This is an incredible fragrance. What else comes in here? It also has a little note and it says you have to uh, be careful because the color of the juice may potentially stain if you're wearing super light colors because obviously look how dark it is. And then it also says that this is to be stored laying down. And I believe that they say that because the cab is so heavy. I mean, this is so top heavy that it could potentially uh, just like fall because I'm telling you, the, the cap is as heavy as the bottle. I mean, it's incredible. But let's take a look at the bottle. I mean, just this cap. If you guys don't know, I have been collecting Swarovski crystals for the longest time. So anything that has crystals like this, I just go gaga. Um, it just, it comes from my dancing days. All of our costumes were filled with Swarovski crystals. I'm sure if you've seen any of those ballroom dresses, that's what I used to wear. And obviously I have been playing with these particular stones for the longest time. I used to make costumes myself. So I am so into the bling bling. I have all, almost all of my jewelry is Swarovski. I love, love the brand and I love the crystal. So when I see high quality, good quality crystals such as this one, I don't know if they are Swarovski though, but it doesn't matter. They're high quality. You can tell by the facets and the way it shines and stuff like that. So this is just a luxury at its finest. Oh my God. Let's just give this, a sp I don't need to spray it, but... Oh my goodness, you can smell it from here. It's a rose, woody, jammy, ambery. Oh my God. Mm. Same spray. This is the fragrance you wear on New Year's. Unless your Christmas is like super like over the top. Usually Christmas for me is like, you know, holiday sweater and like sometimes PJs and stuff like that. It's like super chill or like jeans and like it's nothing really, really big. It's mainly New Year's and since my birthday happens at the same time, then it's a little bit more, you know, over the top. But this is what you wear when you have that sequence stress, when you're going to that glamorous party and you just want to feel like you smell the way you look. <laughs> Incredible. Mm -mm -mm -mm. This is spicy, this is sexy, this is seductive, but it's so smooth. And that is what I find that is hard to achieve in a fragrance. When you have something that is heavy, that is deep, that is extremely present, but it's smooth. Because sometimes the heavier the note and the scent profile, the scratchier it can potentially be. Mm. This is gorgeous. Let's take a look at the notes and learn a little bit more about it. I'm sure you have seen it on the platform, but I have not. And probably you guys, you know, I want to tell you a little bit what I feel about it. On the main accords, warm, spicy, rose, woody, amber, oud, animalic, citrus, leather, powdery, and musky. Again, don't be scared of the animalic. I don't like anything that is animalic. I am too feminine for that, but I don't smell it here whatsoever. And this is odd because usually I detect it right away. Anything that has like, 
just any animalic notes or like latinamen or anything like that it's not really my thing but anyways back to the notes we got bergamot lime and lemon at the top in the middle notes we have rose fig ylang ylang and jasmine tell me that is not a delicious combination and then on the base notes we have agar wood or oud ambergris saffron cinnamon birch civet or is root musk oak moss sandalwood and patchouli it is just gorgeous 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 oh guys guys this is just luxury 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 and what better time to be able to really impress that someone with a little bit of a discount right because 10% may not seem a lot, but these fragrances are so pricey that it's a good chunk of change. If you have someone who is a fragrance connoisseur, someone who's already a collector, someone who definitely knows his stuff, and you know those type of people that you feel like they have it all. Like, what do you give them? They already have it all, even if they have like a full closet of fragrances, and this is what they do, and it's their hobby. I can guarantee you they receive something like this and they're gonna jump up and down like a little five-year-old that just got the best toy in the world because it is just gorgeous. Mm, I absolutely love it. This is definitely as luxurious as it looks. So this was Amber Aoud by Roja Parfum. So this was my lineup for today. Thank you so much for joining me in another video. Let me know what you thought of this luxurious holiday guide for her. These are fragrances that you may potentially own or that you've been curious about. I am so extremely thankful to Twisted Lily for collaborating in this video with me and for Roja Parfum for sending those beautiful gifts. And and I hope that you liked all the choices that I shared from my collection. Everything that I already have are fragrances that you can buy and you can use the discount with. All of these fragrances are super luxurious and I know anyone that you would give them to would be extremely happy. They're the cream of the crop. They're incredible fragrances from incredible houses and I don't think anyone would be mad at receiving any of these. Let me know what are your top luxury fragrances that you wish to have this holiday season. If you have any on your wish list or the ones that you already have and you are dying to use this upcoming holiday season again if you like this video please give it a thumbs up don't forget to subscribe let's make it to 5k by my birthday that would be the best gift that i can receive from you guys i would really appreciate it i want to celebrate this birthday with a bang it would be like super incredible for me so i so so appreciate each and every one of you that took the time to share this video with me today and until the very next week big kiss bye bye